is the energy vibration reading for a deliverance sun, moon, and rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please remember to listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign and the month of uh, March reading. Um, this week is a week of judgment, and it's going to be information coming out and information coming towards you. Whatever secrets, the secrets are going to be revealed in this week. Week begins from the 26th until the 24th. Um, the energy vibration is going to be water, emotional, and the um, zodiac energy is also water. So this is good. On Monday, we have the Queen of Pentacles that you have to be dealing with. So some of you have to be dealing with the Queen of Pentacles on Monday. This is going to be a good energy. Um, this can be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person that you have to deal with on Monday. On Tuesday, you have the energy of the Four of Swords. Whatever is transpiring in your life, you have a, um, Tuesday is going to be a day that you're going to be taking in a um, rest, peace, and guidance on Tuesday. On Wednesday, you have the Nine of Cups. Your wishes and dreams are coming out. So this is going to be positive. This is where you're sitting in a good position. You're feeling good about yourself. Things are going to be happening for you good news that is a sense with the energies of uh, um, Bohor dealing is um, um, energy of information coming at you the crowning of your week is the six of cups so there's going to be a connection with someone from a past life or this could be your hurt family or your cosmic family coming back in your life that you have to do something with so this week the center of your reading is going to be with um, cosmic family of the hurt family there is going to be victorious a uh, successful a victorious winning and victorious overcoming um, this is going to bring endings to whatever situation and happiness um, is going to come out and this is going to be good on Saturday you have the energy of the Emperor and the energy of the Emperor is a, a stable you're trying to bring stability in your life for some people you're going to have some achievement in your work and that sort of a thing and it is going to be very positive on Saturday you could be dealing with someone who is an Aries or a Leo on Sunday um, help is going to come to you um, um, this could be help coming to you um, from unexpected money coming in your life and this is going to be positive um, this is going to be good because um, you're going to be receiving unexpected um, financial help and support it can be from family um, it can be through the form of you receiving something what someone has uh, died and left behind and this is going to be um, very positive so as I look at your week it's going to be a positive week some of you will be trying to balance out your financial situation and your emotion um, this is going to be your focus for the week so your crown is going to be working out situation with family members and that sort of a thing and um, your focus in the week is going to be the two of Pentacles so, so let's look at your week to see what is happening you have an earth energy which you're beginning the week with and then you have the air energy on Tuesday on Wednesday you have um, the emotional energy but this is good emotion because this is the week of judgment information coming in break shoes and then on Thursday you have a situation that you have to deal with either your a cosmic family of uh, your cosmic family or your family and this is going to be um, very very positive then we have the energy of uh, celebrations another wonderful energy coming up and this is a celebration with your um, um, work but it can also be celebrated in overcoming certain aspect of your life and you you begin the week with an earth energy and you're ending the week with an earth energy so it's as if this Queen of Pentacles is going to come in your life to bring some sort of a balance in your life which is going to be moving you to a positive place we're going to look at the first half of the week the first half of the week you have um, this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and there is a, a celebration with this person or this person is bringing an end to something and bringing a celebration in your life and on Tuesday it's going to bring you happiness and joy so whatsoever that was happening with the energy the four of swords um, this is in reverse uh, for, 
four of swords is in reverse in the beginning of the week and this is good because um, now you uh, the rest in period is over and now things are going to be moving forward which is extremely good as we look at the middle of the week um, some of you are going to um, you know take it easy at work um, they're saying taking easy at work um, whatever you're doing in your life just take it easy take it at a slow pace um, because you don't have to be pushing and going forward you just need to take the middle of the week with a little bit of rest whatever that was transpiring um, where people were sending you negative energies or trying to do things um, this is going to be in reverse form it's as if information is going to be coming at you that is going to bring balance in your work world but yet still in bringing um, balance in your um, personal life and by bringing this balance in your personal life a lot of success is going to be coming out and a lot of your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out so this is good because um, these cards that is in reverse is much um, better for you guys as we look at the end of the week you have the nine of cups your wishes and dreams about your financial situation it's going to be working out for you and um, if there was a sense of uh, imbalance in your financial um, life with your family or your cosmic family um, um, with the energy of uh, um, someone who is an, an Aquarius uh, or Gemini you know some of you men between the ages of uh, this is the king this is the prince some of you men who are um, 25 and older 25 until 40 and older you are going to have a situation you have to deal with a situation in your life and you are going to be in a reverse form so um, this could be that you have you are giving out this um, financial help to your family this can be happening for a lot of you guys so um, expect this to happen but for the rest of you it's gonna be wonderful it's gonna be a positive um, energy that is coming in a really 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 um, positive energies that is coming in for most of you so as I look at your reading and you know trying to figure out this for the people who are connecting with um, the um, um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn people this is going to be a wonderful week especially in the beginning of the week because things are going to be happening things are going to be balancing out whatever the situation was there is going to be an explosion but yet still peace is going to come in for the people who were having situation where you know things wasn't going your way and that sort of a thing it is now over okay whoever that was there and especially um, you men whatever the situation that was transpiring in the men between the ages of 25 and older um, good things are going to be coming out so um, not to worry about this because this is going to be good um, whatever that is going on in your life in this week it is um, going to be a very very positive because what is going to transpire is that there is going to be wonderful good situations coming out and positive positive energies coming out so whoever you are out there know that in this week um, um, if you have a situation with your father um, that is a Leo or a, a Leo or a Aries whatever that situation was and whatever um, energies that was being between both of you it's going to be okay all right we are using the energy from the and a note a message from the universe and you guys have this energy coming up it is good because you have an hurt um, sign a uh, hurt color that is coming up for you guys and it's just going to be extremely wonderful so let's see what is happening it says it says yes when you first thought of it now when you first ask and uh, hallelujah so be it come right up when you um, when your first 
give thanks in advance for what it is that you want so I'm always telling people always give thanks in advance to what is it that you want to um, come in your life and then you will see it automatically appearing without an even a force so you have the brown energy but yet still you have orange and green so your financial situation is going to be good but yet still positive wonderful situation is going to be coming in your life which is going to be good because you're going to feel a sense of joy and happiness that is going to prevail in your life in this week okay let's look if you have a question you can ask your question at this time because by asking your question at this time the angels I'm working with the angels answer it is the first week of the month of March so whatever your question was the answer is take action take action okay and whenever the energy of take action comes up it is letting you know that whatever it is that you're asking for you need to take some actions for it to come in your life and it is it will come in okay so um, it is a wonderful week um, whenever um, whatever is happening um, with you having these wonderful situations because a lot of people are going to have situation with their family or their soul family their earth family or their cosmic family which is going to be good but the balancing out of this week because you have the swords energy comes up on Tuesday so Tuesday is going to be one of your very very best day Tuesday is going to be one of your very very best day and on Tuesday a lot of positive situation is going to be coming up the number six energy is for you the number six is working together on to bring forward um, a good positive um, a swing in your materialistic endeavor and this is going to be good so I want to say to each and every person um, please remember to listen to the Sun Moon and Rising sign namaste until next week